started, the first thing we need to check is a couple of packages. I'm just going to use Synaptic and double check that you have Java Runtime Environment installed along with SVN or Subversion. If you have those, go ahead and close out. Now we're going to take a trip over to netbeans.org and download the latest 7.1.1 release. I'm just going to put this on the desktop. Now from here, let's open a terminal and launch our sh file, sh, star.sh. Carefully read our license agreements. Pick where you want to install, and it should find your path. I like to contribute, but if you don't, take off the check. Click Finish. Now that we're done with that, you can double check. Should be in your development tools. So let's grab a copy of Webcam Studio. WS4GL.org It's compiling for new Linux. We're just going to copy the SVN command. And like NetBeans, put it on the desktop. Okay. Now let's launch NetBeans. And we need to open the trunk project. So from here, open project. And since it's on the desktop, scroll down a bit. You will see your webcam studio read-only folder. And highlight trunk, and open project. You can basically ignore this for now. Just close that out. And let's build it. Little green play button. Looks like everything worked. There I am. Now you can repeat this every time you want to launch Webcam Studio, but if you want to build a local copy, it's not that difficult. Let's close out NetBeans and go into our Webcam Studio read-only folder. Go into Trunk. And there's a README file. Let's have a look. All you need to run is ANT clean jar. So let's do that. Now we should have a compiled version. Let's visit the dist folder. And there's our jar. Easy enough to launch. Just Java dash jar start out jr and should start simple as that